back at it again. We're back at it again. It's time for Ibira Horror of the Deep, uh, 1966. So let's go, let's go. Keep it up with the Board AF vlogs. Yeah, boy. The story so far is that there are these four characters. Uh, hindi sila magkakakilala or yung isa lang yung hindi magkakakilala or mag hindi niya kilala yung tatlo na magkakasama uh, kasi yung tatlong yun pumunta, naghanap ng yacht tapos pumasok sila dito sa isang yacht kahit di naman sa kanila tapos meron palang nag-aabang na isa pang karakter yung kasama nila ngayon tapos yun pala hindi niya rin hindi rin sa kanya yung yacht na yun so magnanakaw siya tapos yung isang naka white na character parang may kamag-anak siya or kapatid niya yata na ano kasama dun sa nangyaring shipwreck na nabalitaan sa somewhere in the sea so kinabukasan ano bit parang nagising yung tatlo yung uh, magnanakaw yung dalawang magkaibigan nandun sila sa loob ng ano ng boat or ng yacht tapos pagkagising nila ano nasa ocean na yung ano nasa dagat na yung yung ship tapos minamaneho ng ano ng isang mas yung isang medyo bata na ano na white na character naka white hindi siya white ano siya Japanese tapos ano <coughs> Tapos, parang may storm, tapos may, ano, parang may malaking claw na dumating. Tapos, ano, parang yun, nasira yung boat nila. Tapos, na, nandito sila ngayon sa, ano, sa, sa island. Tapos, yun, yun pala may istorya. Man yung claw. Ah, uh, si Ibira. Siya yata yun. Ibira, horror of the deep. Ano yata siya, a lobster na malaki. Na kaiji. Yeah. Okay, so, mga monster worshipper, wor, eto, monster worshipper to. Tapos yung, meron pa mga monster worshipper kanina. Tapos ginamit sila pang, ano, ginamit sila pang, ano, pang sacrifice dun sa Ebira. Parang kinuha sila ng mga, uh, parang military type na, ano, na mga go, ano organization ewan ko parang secret organization tapos yun pinunta sila pinapunta sila dun sa isang island pero hindi yata yun infant island tapos mga ano sila mga native worshipper sila ni Mostra tapos yun <laughs> tawag dun sa parang military force na yun or secret uh, organization ay red bamboo um, yun tapos kinuha sila kinuha yung mga native uh, Mothra worshippers oh yan na si Mothra medyo faded na yung costume o yung model pero si ano yan si Mothra yung Shubijin twins hindi na sila yung original mga iba na to parang iba yung to yung tone ng ano ng movie na to kasi iba yung director <laughs> uh, kaya pala iba yung director niya iba din yung special effects director um yun yung yun si Jun Fukuda Jun Fukuda director of Ibira Horror of the Deep try susunod Son of God sila so yung director so yung director noon uh, wala lang just wanna point that out so, ano nangyari kay Godzilla dito lang siya St ano stuck in the rubble of a cave actually hindi ko na maalala kung ano nangyari sa kanya nung ano eh no, last na movie invasion of astro monster alam ko parang bigla na lang sila nawala eh uh, ni Rodan pero hindi ko maalala ewan ko baka hindi to 
Baka hindi nila pinansin yung continuity or something. I don't know. <laughs> okay, okay. Very interesting, this movie. It has world building. It has world building. Parang, yun nga, sa lahat ng movies, ito yung parang, they're trying to widen up the 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 world or the story or the 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 connectedness of the universe as in ito yung mga mothra yung mga mothra worshippers they they were you they are being used for another monster kasi yung yellow liquid na ginag, yung ginagawa nilang yellow liquid ginagamit para din sa mga ship ng mga red bamboo para mataboy si ano si Ibira wow that's that's some that's what you call world building you're trying to make sense of ano your of the world of these movies the connectedness grabe ang ganda or interesting pero yun yeah. let's go let's keep it up with this watching of the movie blah 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 Oh, gising na siya! Oh my god, Lilia! Look at that! Look at that! Oh. Uh, rising from the grave! Bro, this is definitely something you wanna see. <laughs> Maglalaro sila ng ano, volleyball. Or at least ano, boulder, ano, boulder toss. lalabanan sila ng ano <laughs> eh magaway sila tapos ano yan ibabato niya ulit tapos matatamaan yung ano <laughs> bagong ano kalaban saan ba yun para siyang vulture na ano Ayan, sayang. Bahala na. It's <laughs> na, the end. Ooh, Ibira, Horror of the Deep, 1965. Um, this was definitely a Gaiden story, a short story. Gaiden is short story for Japanese Ata. Uh, wait lang. If I fact check ko lang yung sarili ko. Gaiden. Gaiden meaning. Gaiden is a Japanese language word meaning side story or tale. Used to refer to an anecdote or supplementary by bi- 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 Okay. So yun. Side story or tale lang siya. It's definitely, it definitely feels like a a side story or a short story a very light mood uh, story where Godzilla is just there he's just minding his own business trying to sleep inside of an island while uh, a group of uh, a group of uh, a group organization is trying to make atom bombs in that island secretly um, and then Uh, they kidnapped all of these native worshippers ni Mothra in order to ano, help with trying to avoid being uh, killed by Ibira every time they go to the island kasi yung mga ships uh, destroy ni Ibira um, unless gumagamit ka ng yellow liquid which the the Mothra sir the Mothra worshippers know how to do so kaya sila kinidnap and yun um, ang ganda okay siya maganda siya pero not as good uh, not as high level as all of the other movies syempre mas maganda yung, yung last na movie na pinanood ko ay ano pala siya 1966 1966 yung Ibira Horror of the Deep Ikamali ako. Yung 1965 pala. In- invasion of Our Astro Monster. So yun. Hindi siya kasing level ng a- Invasion of Astro Monster. Pero 
with the direction that they went to um parang na okay yan lang ako na okay yan lang ako na okay yan ako dun sa story kasi you know it's not always supposed to be grand or big or heavy heavy with plot and uh, all of these other ano, um, monsters you know so uh, it was a nice touch it was it was a nice addition to the movies to the movie so far and seeing na different director to um, I get na uh, I understand why this was the case for this movie very different tone siya. It's a, diff- it's a different kind of movie for this genre, for this kaiju verse uh, Godzilla franchise whatever. Um, yun. Sobrang ano lang niya. Sobrang uh, maliit lang tong movie na to. Pero, that doesn't mean that this does this movie doesn't have quality. It does have quality. It does have some things that I don't know. If you're if if you're like me who's been binge watching all of these movies for like I don't know how many days is this 11 days or 10 days or whatever what was my point um yun uh you're gonna enjoy this you're gonna enjoy this kasi it's just adding to the lore and the world building uh it tries to you know it tries to interweave all of these existing characters and monsters inside of this world. This world is big. This world is huge. If you're, if you already have Godzilla, King Kong, Mothra, Ghidorah, Rodan, um, there is that octopus guy. Tapos mga ano pa? Uh, uh, yon si Ibira the 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 very recent tapos yung yung at least very brief moment lang yung Ukondoru yung un, yung ah Ukondoru yun the Ukondoru yun yung parang vulture uh, character or monster kanina na very brief lang yung ano niya very brief lived uh, screen time kasi bigla na lang siyang namatay gamit yung atomic breath ni ano ni Godzilla. So yun. Uh, this is not as good as Godzilla, of course. Pero kino-consider ko siya kanina. Kino-consider ko kung gagawin ko siyang 8 out of 10. Kasi kahit pa paano, uh, th- it's not bad. It's not bad, but it's not as good as the the good movies, the good movies. So I'm gonna give it a 7.8 or a 7.9 actually yun 7.8 kasi by the third act by almost the ending part medyo parang ano parang nahabaan na ako dun sa third third act so yun kaya siya 7.8 lang would have been 7.9 pero yun nga 7.8 kasi uh, tsaka rin kasi yung, mga mini- yung isang miniature set na prop lang nila or yung design ano na lang yung set na yun yung buong set na yun sobrang alam alam mo na ano na miniature set siya hindi siya ganun ka ano. the lighting was off Godzilla was just it is suit mission character talaga um, and then the, ang- the camera angles were ano, were bad were not uh believable or ano, yun, convincing enough for me for my kind of taste so maganda yung ano maganda yung s- here's the thing you have Godzilla who is so ano, sort of an all around type of monster so he's basically a land creature um, ang pinaka nahihirapan siyang kalabanin si Mothra eh kasi she's uh, an aerial type monster and having another type of uh, elemental uh, kaiju being such as Ebira na is centered around the sea or the water ganun uh, you 
have a very interesting way of ano. There comes this very interesting and very um, creative way in order to still make Godzilla uh, an interesting character to watch or a monster to watch. Because you gotta you gotta know how you gotta know how he deals with certain different types of creatures um, coming his way or disturbing his peace uh, within within his world. Um, yun. So Ibira, Horror of the Deep, is very much a good movie. It's a good movie. He is a good character, uh, a good monster. Pero I feel yun, wala ako kasi tinitingnan ko yung mga ano dito. Tinitingnan ko yung list ng ano ng movies. Gagawa talaga ako ng bagong list kasi hindi siya organized, hindi siya ano. It's only focused on movies where Godzilla is. It's hindi wala ako nakikitang kaiju verse na. Ano. So I'm going to do that after I watch all of these. Or at least the Showa era lang. The Showa area or era. Pero pagka dating dun sa Heisei the Heisei era, tsaka sa Millennium era, uh, those are gonna be separate, separate eras talaga. I'm gonna, I'm gonna rearrange the, the timeline, or the chronology, or the year list, um, for all of these. So, uh, Ibira, Horror of the Deep, 7.8 out of 10, like and subscribe if you have not already, hit the bell to get notified, and I'll see you in the next one for... King Kong Escapes 1967 Yeah, let's go